Hi guys and welcome to One Lock Head. Why are we here? One Lock Head is the highest village in Scotland and it sits at 1531 feet above sea level. Right, and we'll go to a wee walk. Right, we're going to a wee walk in the village. Uh, right, right, so there's uh, I can hear some ducks. Right, watch this car, kids. Oh, well, guys, you can probably see to hear here. There's a uh, few ducks. It's a turkey. <laughs> See me, turkey. The ducks are all looking at me. Right, where's... Right. Brooklyn. Right, we'll let's walk through this way. There's more coming right, hold William's hand. Hold this one. <laughs> right. Come on, tell me what we're doing this way. And we'll see what's happening. I think we're waiting up the village here. Look at this. <laughs> right, well guys, we'll take a walk down here. Well, this wee village is, is in Dumfries. Down at the Lead Hills. And in this village, you've got the, the Lead Hill Museum. There's an old motor there, can you see it? It's been wrapped up. I wonder what kind of car that is in there. So, anyway, let's go. I'll take a wee morning stroke. So there's a wee museum down here, so we're going to have a wee look at it. It's 8 o'clock in the morning, so things are nice and quiet. There's not a great deal of people around about. But anyway guys, I'll cut back in when I get further down the road. Guys, excuse me if this camera is shaking. There I go, it's following me. Oh, but doesn't chase after me. <laughs> See ya. Right, here we go. Look at this over here. Narrow gauge railway 
Lead Hills, one mile. All right. Let's see this. Excuse me, people, this phone is shaking, but I've just got my, just used my horn here to hold this phone. So one lock head village. Aye, yeah, it's the highest one in Scotland. 1500 feet above sea level. So, the Museum of Lead Mining Visitor Centre. Oh aye. I want you to come back and see this one day. I say guys, we're just roaming past and stumbled across this wee village. So this is the museum. I dare say you can see the drawings there. With the carvings out of the, the metal. And the carts that must have carried the lead. So we maybe I don't know when, I don't know the history of this place, but aye. So I dare say they were taking the lead out of the hills. And that's how they transported it. Anyway, <coughs> there's a wee river here. Look at the colour of the mountain. The mountain, the hill. Uh, changing the season. Uh, purple. Oh, uh, the heather turns. Ah, it turns purple. Put it that way. Mm hmm. The kids are up there. So there's a lot of history in this place. Uh, it says, I'm just reading there on a wee plaque that the miners used to mine in 1820, 1830. Uh, nearly 200 years. 200 year old. But you can see the landscape. No wonder they call it the Lead Hills. I'm just passing through, guys, so I'd like to spend a wee bit more time here, but I've not really got time to uh, make it a wee bit longer. So, a oh, stunning location. Look at that. Right, we'll follow a few paths to see what it takes. Right. I just got this wee bit here. See if we can get a better view. And the kids come in. Here come in.
Brooklyn, see up there? I think there's a school up there. Yeah. Uh -huh. Right. Look at that. Nice, yeah, huh? Again, we need to start you in memory of World War One. Must be the guys that fought in the war from this village, in the Great War. So let me start you that. But anyway, so that there is a local community centre. One Lockheed. Yep. Yeah, we see here. Enjoy the view. Established 1756. Wow. The miners' library. Mm -hmm. There's a wee gate here, come on, we'll go in this wee gate. No, don't want to jump Oh, wait, go, go get it, quick! Quick, get it! Right, come on, we'll go in the wee park, we'll sit at the bench. Right. right, come on. Okay. Oh, this way. Come on. Let me see. I'll fucking get it. No, I don't. Silence on a Sunday morning. Can you whack it? You get it? Oh, Brook, he winds balls right down there, nearly in the water. Oh, 
Look at that guys, look, look at that more up there, look. Right, come on, we'll head back. Right.